Happy Tuesday, Crafty Friends. Hello, everybody. So, today, okay, while we were through a treat, we made a card with this amazing tree die from Picket Fence. And I didn't buy it when I was there because I don't do uh, slimline cards. I usually just do A2 cards. So, excuse me. <clears throat> so sorry. Um, so, <clears throat> I didn't buy it. And it has haunted me because, you know, you're probably thinking, are you into trees lately? Because I got that embossing forest folder and <clears throat> uh, maybe I am. But I, I have suddenly, with these, I can see all the possibilities. Like, this could be spring, summer, winter, fall, Halloween, you know, whatever you, fairy, whatever you want it to be. And just because it is for a slim line does not mean that I have to create it that way. So... That's what I'm going to do today. And I'm going to do the background like we kind of like we did it there because it was so very cool. Mm -hmm. And um, we also used the picket fence pouncers there, which Bestie won a set of them. I did. I was so happy. And she loves them. But I'm still using my regular, you know, domed thingies. So anyway, we're just going to make a background and uh, we'll see what happens. Now, I'm using... I'm going to use my um, Color Hive inks because they're so vivid. Let me just show you my color they're, chart. They're, they're yummy. They're like this. Okay. So, I'm going to put that right there for myself to look at. And then, I'm just going to start picking colors because, and, and going with it. Uh... Because, oh, squeaky. You hear that squeakiness? Hey, I heard a little bit of something. Okay, okay. good. Alright, so, these things are so juicy. Watch this. You gotta make the spooky sounds with it as you go. Now, so this could be the sun coming up. It could be glow from the moonlight. It could be whatever you want it to be. So there's that color. And I am going to shoot for, let's see, outrageous. I'm going to shoot for a, uh, like a real ombre kind of a, and this is how we, um, we did it. We, we got our color on and then we stenciled over the top of it. And, um, and the more we well, did, go ahead. I the, was say something, but go ahead. the more we did, the cooler it got, you know. Mm -hmm. What I was going to say is the thing about those pouncers is you don't, you can pounce them instead of rubbing them out. Yeah. Sometimes the pencils will tear. Oh, well, that's the thing, too. Now, now it's coming back to me. We didn't do the background first. The tr we glued the tree down first, and then we pounced over the top of them. We did. Yeah, and that was the that was the selling point of those was that because you're pouncing and not rubbing. It um, I, remember? I we did the opposite. Uh uh. I thought we did yellow, yellow for the background, then pink pounce the orange leaves and then put the tree over it. Hmm. Well, I thought that was the whole reason we did the pouncing. Oh. Was to, uh, because she oh. wanted to show that, um, it wouldn't tear the stencil, you know, yeah. or the something delicate, it wouldn't tear it. Right. I don't know. What do we know? We know we liked it. That's what we know. Well, she had several for us, and I don't have a, um, leaves out here, but I have other things that I'm going to use. Yeah. But I've got my tree over the top of that where we stenciled. That's where mine is. I don't know how you did yours. You might have 
I don't know how I did it either. To be perfectly honest. All I know is I liked I just liked how it came out. So there you go and there you have it. Alright. So then now I have my my um I have this crackle. Let's see. Oh, I could put some of those stars in there. That might be kind of cool. Let's see. I have the little stars and the big stars. Oh, in the background of it? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. 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 Um, but I also have this stencil. Yeah, if I can pick it up. That I got in a... Not that one. In a set from a... Oh, this one's what I should use. In a set from Timo. And it is kind of crazy. Yeah. Kind of, uh, oh. Oh, and I had an idea. Let's see. How about, I'm about to use some paste on here, bestie. I said I'm about to use some paste on here. Are you? I am. Good. Let's see. I think I'll use this. Oh, I didn't even need to buy any little scissors. I can just spend a little set. And I have no idea where they came from in their pistols. They're blue, black, and white. You know, I was thinking about that when I was getting the pistols. Because I've used this and it's dried on there, it's not uh, it's not going down in my it's not going down in my cracks like I want it to. <laughs> so you know what? No, you use your finger in that case because your finger can always get whatever it needs off in the cracks. Yeah, yeah. Mhm. That. Okay, that's kind of cool. Now I gotta put that in the in the washing bucket. I cannot find my white gel pen anywhere. Oh my. You need to always have your white gel pen at the fingertips. At the fingers, right? Uh -huh. I can't find it anywhere. Huh? A splat brush? Yeah, it's a Tim Holtz splat brush. Muscle it's cool. long, it's long the uh, bristles, and you just take your finger or you just throw it, throw paint or whatever you want to, splatten it on there. Does it look oh, like this? What is this? I can't <laughs> see. You'll have to watch the video now, won't you? It already. That's where you found out about it. Oh, man. <laughs> I don't need to bring mine now. Oh, yeah, that's fine. That'll be fine. That'll be fine. I'm coming for a visit, y'all. Yes, she is. Mm -hmm. Not this weekend, but the next. Yeah. Yes, we are. Fun is going to be had. It is. Really. Really. Really it really. is. Really. really. Okay. So, now. Oh, look at that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now, let me get my glue. And. Kind of a hit and a lick because every single little thing doesn't have to be stuck, but you 
can get a lot of it just kind of here and there in it, you know what I mean? And then if it if something doesn't stick, you can always go back. Cause nothing's stopping you. Okay. So you're going down right there. Like that. Get on there straight. Ish. Ish. Mm hmm Straight ish. Alright. Mm-hmm. That was wet. That's okay. Now, I'm going to take my tree parts. Your tree parts? Yeah, everybody's got some tree parts. <laughs> and, I'm going to snip them here and there. And here and there, and there and here. Let's see, I believe I'll cut it right there. Then I'm going to glue that there. And then once I get this like I want it, I can put things in the trees. I can put something over the top of it. I can do ever what and whatever I want to. Or I could just put a sentiment on there. You know what I mean? Hello? Hello, I guess I do know what you mean. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes you gotta you gotta get bestie to um have a conversation with you. Well you know. Yes, I do. And yes, I do. Uh, oh, I think it should shoot off this way. So you just lay it up there and you say to yourself, self, where would a branch be? And that's where you put it. Where the branch be? Yeah, because I'm adding branches to it. Oh, well, then you're not going to show me how to cut my card that's already made, then. Yes, you will see. You will see. Because I can't take my tree off. It's already glued down. I know. Yours is, yours is a... Uh, I was going to say, well, you could cut another tree. <laughs> no, I don't I guess can. you can I from... I don't guess you can from where you are. Mm-mm. Mm -mm. I can do that when I get to your house. True that. And true that. And the more branches you add, the better it gets. I wish there was a way we could FaceTime while you're doing your videos. Yeah, I know. That would be cool. Well, you could. I mean, I think there is a way. I just don't think we know it. I mean, you could FaceTime on your phone, but you'd have to have a holder. Yep. I got no holder. Mm -mm. Now, well, you know, I can't let this good little branch right here go to waste. So you going to put it on there? Yeah. That's fine. We'll make it match up to that. Now, anywhere there's a little flapper, I'll put a little dab of glue down. Put a little flip flat flapper? Mm-hmm. And then, I'll just go and snip the hanger offers off. The hanger off. <laughs> that is a technical term for branches that hang <laughs> off of your card. Oh, that. Yep. Technical term. All day long. And then if you had like a Xyron, you know, of course, then you would have the issue of all these little pieces. So, you talking about the uh, uh huh. 
you know, if what are you about it? I'm saying if if you ran this through your sticker maker, yeah. all these little pieces would would be stuck. You know, yeah. they would yeah. all have adhesive on them, so you wouldn't have to go back like I'm doing and. I know, it gives it depth. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Okay, so now that I've done that, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna take this and add me some brown down here. Like that. Yeah, man. Okay. So, what do y'all think of that? I think that is beautiful. I still think I want to put a little bit more glue down here. Just slop it on there. Slap it with my finger. Slop it and slap it. Click, slap it, slop, slop. Mm hmm. Because it'll stick then. And it's not going to show, you know. And this is my favorite glue. And what about your favorite glue? Art glitter glue. Because yeah. barely art glue buckles my paper in my climate, I guess is why. Now, where yeah. Scrappy Shack, their, the official glue of Scrappy Shack is barely art glue. But yeah. me, not for me. I like, the, I like the art glitter glue. But, you know, you can't really move something around. No, you but... Can use it. I don't really need to do that anyway. Yeah. And if I do, I just pull it off with wild abandon. Oh, you know. Real good. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. Oh, there's one piece I left. I am still on the hunt for my pen. I think that piece might be a, a throwaway. Okay, so, y'all let me know what you think. And. I'll do like I did with the um, with the card that I made, the winter scene and the little bear, and I'll make uh -huh. I'll make so I'll make one of these winter. And when we were there, um, one of the examples that they had, they had taken the tree and stenciled, and then moved the tree down just a little bit, so it looked like there was like a light behind it. And you could also do that to make it look like there was a snow effect behind it. Oh, okay. Or you could add some glossy accents along all of the... That's crazy. Yeah. But isn't that cool? Ugh, I love it. It's ready for any kind of a stamp image to go on there. A creepy person. You know. Any kind of a thing. So, yeah. that's what I'm playing with today. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, just playing, you know, just playing, playing and talking to Bestie. Yeah, so, right. yep, <laughs> Lily's, Lily has robotics, uh, so I didn't have to leave as early to go pick her up. Yeah. Henceforth and hitherto, I am still here. Yeah, still talking to me. Still yakking, mm-hmm, that. Mm -hmm. So, Anywho, I hope y'all have a wonderful day, and I hope you're getting to do something crafty. Let me know what you think about my tree. Love you guys. Blessings. Bye. <laughs>